Let's do it. Come on. What's up, baby? No, 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 no. Uh. We're turning the max, getting what it is, what it does, what it is, what it isn't. Looking for a better way to get up out of bed instead of getting on the internet and checking a new hymn and get up. Through shop, pimp shop, walking, little bit of humble, little bit of cautious. Somewhere between like Rocky and Cosby. Twitter gang, nope, nope, y'all can't copy ya. Bad moonwalking, this here is our party. My posse's been on. Hey guys, so today I'm going to be showing you how I like to prep for a big event and get ready before I do my hair and my makeup. So we're going to start off with our skin. As you can see, I have acne. It's an ongoing problem. But before the event, try to avoid using products that break you out or new products because you're not sure if those are going to break you out or not. Stick to your old faithfuls. You'll be happy that you did. So I'm just pulling my hair back to keep it out of my face. And now I'm going to go in with this Dermalogica uh, clearing mask and this comes with my Dermalogica kit and so I'm just going to apply that mostly on the areas where I have acne issues and then I'm going to spread out excess all over my face. I love this mask. I use it once a week and I find that it really does help my skin to feel super smooth. So you have to leave it on for 10 minutes and once those 10 minutes are up you can go ahead and rinse it off or take it off with a nice soft gentle washcloth and some warm water. When you're finished, your skin will feel absolutely to die for. Now, we all have it, that little pink fuzz on our upper lip. It's just part of being a girl. I'm pretty sure that everyone in the world has it. So, instead of waxing, I like to use this Nair face cream. And make sure that you get the face kind and not like the normal body kind, because you need something that's going to be really gentle on your skin. And I just go ahead and apply that, just like I'm wearing a mustache. I know it looks really silly, and I know it's something that we don't like to talk about, because who wants to talk about having a mustache? But uh, it's just something that we all deal with, and it's super important to take this off before an event. Obviously, you don't want a mustache. So you're going to keep that on for 10 minutes and no longer, and then you're going to use a warm washcloth or some cotton pads to take it off. And when you use cotton pads, you can really see all the little hairs on it, and you know that it's working. And now we're going to go ahead and moisturize. I'm using my Cetaphil moisturizer, pretty standard for me. I'm going to just go ahead and apply pretty generously to my skin because we just use a lot of products on it and we want to make sure that we get that moisture back in there. Make sure that you pay extra attention to the area underneath your eyes because I at least tend to get very dry under there. And also to the area where you just applied the Nair cream to make sure that that gets nice and soft and moisturized after using that sort of harsh product on it. And now for lips, I am using my Lush Sweet Lips Exfoliant, but I actually made a video a long time ago about how to make your own lip exfoliant, and I will try to remember to annotate that on the screen, that way you can see it. I love this one though, it tastes delicious, although you probably shouldn't lick it off because I'm pretty sure it pulls off all your dead skin on your lips. That's probably not good for you, but if you can't avoid it. I highly recommend <laughs> eating it because it really does taste good. But I'm just going to go ahead and take it off with a washcloth and now my lips are perfectly smooth. And to finish my lips off, I'm going to apply my EOS lip balm. This one is in Blueberry and it's my favorite. Super, super moisturizing. I'm obsessed with this one right now. Alright, now I am going to let my hair down and push it back into its normal way of being. <laughs> and now we are going to go ahead and work on our hair. We want it to be shiny and smooth and wonderful. So this is a blow dry cream from Fruit, uh, Garnier Fructis that I apply obviously before blow drying my hair, but I also like to apply it about uh, every two days. Uh, so sort of in that time right before I rewash my hair, just to the roots of my hair because it really does help to smooth it down and keep my hair feeling really soft and it smells amazing, guys. And now I'm going in with my BioSoak Silk Therapy Cream for my hair. I've been using this stuff for so long, you need literally the tiniest, tiniest bit. And once again, I'm applying that just to the bottom of my hair, that way um, my hair doesn't get all greasy near the scalp. And this adds shine into my hair, once again makes it feel super soft, and it smells 
so good. And I noticed that these two scents don't like combine together to smell bad, so don't worry about using both at the same time. <laughs> Okay guys, this is my new obsession, Vaseline Spray to Go Moisture. Holy moly, I apply this every single day. It's especially nice right after you get out of the shower. You just spray it onto your skin and then rub it in a little bit and your skin feels so, so soft and smells so good. I absolutely cannot recommend this stuff enough. It's a drugstore and amazing. Okay, now it's time to get to those clutch essentials. So I have this clutch, which I stole from my mom, but I really like it because it has a mirror inside so you don't have to worry about trying to stuff a mirror in there too. Number one, you obviously need whatever sort of cards you need. You're going to need your powder. I also like to bring a few bobby pins and a hair tie. I also like to throw in whatever lip color I'm wearing for that day. How gorgeous is this one? from the Kate line. I believe this is Revlon or Rimmel London, whatever. And then obviously my cell phone. So I like to put the cards into this little pocket here because it keeps them safe and out of the way. Then I just stick my powder in with the little brush that I have. That brush is actually from Benefit, I believe. Then the lipstick and the hair tie and bobby pins. And finally my cell phone and this clutch is stuffed to the brim, you cannot fit anything else in there. You really do have to narrow down what exactly you need for your clutch. Thank you all so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.